Hey, thanks for coming back. Right now we're just doing some odd jobs here while we wait for Taka, Naka, Taka, whatever the hell his name is, him to call us. So we're going to go see Judy. Judy, Judy, Judy. Herself to express her undying gratitude to you for stop talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. Got to do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Let's no. get out of here before the cops Today. show. What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you. If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? <laughs> That's one way to get them to show up. Fine. I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. Okay. Here you go, Judy. What next? <sighs> They'll be here soon. Well, good. Time to leave, then. Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? You know, to you, she was your best friend, so it's a terrible tragedy. But they must get dozens of calls like this every day. What are you? The fucking PR rep? No, just saying. Let's read this first. Okay, we read it. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. True. Could you wait outside? Yeah, sure. Close the door, V. Please. Oh, come on. I want to watch. Okay, well, that was the end of that. That was a short mission. After this, we'll go talk to Panam. That sticks. Oh, wrong game. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. I don't. Uh, quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, okay. V, just one. Okay. Here. That was her smoke case. She smokes some strange boutique brand. But that's Evie. Whenever she pulled on a new face, it was down to the details. A lot of people know the real Evelyn, who she really was. No. no. Nobody. Didn't think so. Good old fashioned big lighter, even in the future. Fuck, Evie. I let her down. Oh, that's what if I she gave did. her some oh, space no. or time, she'd get back on her feet. Can't wrap my head around it. I never saw Evelyn as the type to give up. Come on. What she went through? I wouldn't call it giving up. Nice hair she's got going there, eh? Her condition, couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her and had his way with her. The things he did. Oh, that sounds creepy. 
And once he got bored, he'd ponder off. I zeroed Woodman. Didn't plan on it. Just how the chips landed. Oh, Glad well. I did, though. <laughs> Me too. I can't even imagine. Still, it's not enough. There are so many more like him. Yep. Gotta be something I can do about it. He needs to uh, speak like faster. What? Don't know yet. I think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise yep. to keep in touch. Let's go. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. Let's get out of Dodge. Okay, so let's go to Panam. Let's find me a road. Find me a car. This could be a long trip. Oh, <laughs> sorry, man. So, let's go meet with Anam. Alright, through the magic of editing, <laughs> we're here. <laughs> v, it's good you're here. And we'll see what she's got for us. What happened? Spit it out. The wraiths took Saul. Oh shit. The brick brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was wraiths? We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. Always pan out. You and me are chooms. Chooms. I'm that guessing clear. that's friend. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. <laughs> Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grad. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Calders. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. All right, so we'll get the details of this, and this will finish up this episode, because this is a long set of missions. Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V, what's going on there? Him? After what happened to Scorpion, he shows up here? I guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Yes, yeah, I will. Pan Am, seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. Yeah, yeah. You know okay. you have a pistol, right. Mason, right? Someone well, has to. Uh, no, I have cumin and chili. Uh, yeah, uh huh. Where are we yes. going? Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh? You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Exactly. Oh, I gotta lean against the car. Okay, how you wanna do this? Quietly. An open assault would be An suicide. An open assault would be suicide. Yeah, it would. Recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Wait. Meaning it's just gonna be us two? What about all you guys? Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek, static. And I don't know. Your leader gets nabbed, and you what? Hope for the best? Rather than I think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. Yeah, no shit. You're asking for trouble. Leave it. He has a right not to understand. It's Mitch. There's Mitch. 
I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. Oh, yes, they this is going to take a while. Cement plant to squat in with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time, do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why? Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in. Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building, there. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. I feel like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. All right. Is everything clear? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. All right. So, this is where we we'll leave this mission, and we'll pick it up on the next part. So for now, make sure you subscribe, ring the bell, drop a comment, drop a like, tell me what you think. So for now, I'm out. Either way, it'll have to.